let's begin with a gentle warm-up dance. We'll do lots of repetitions, but I will throw some challenges your way, so follow me as best as you can and just have fun with the drum and with the dancing. Don't worry too much about your technique because we're gonna get to that afterwards. Yalla Habibi, let's get started in basic belly dance posture with our feet a couple of inches apart, our knees bent, hips tucked forward, abs in and up, chest lifted, shoulders relaxed. How about we start with our hands out here and just do a basic, nice, easy sway and Now 
do some hip circles, chest circles, hips and chest, hips and chest, hips and chest.
what'd you do with that? Really fun, right? But some of it was, I bet, was challenging, especially because you didn't know what I was gonna do. You were trying to follow me and listen to the music, and that's exactly why we teach the way that we do, so that you can learn to hear the music and respond with the moves that you want to do without following me or a memorized choreography. For the next 40 minutes, we're gonna slow it way down and learn and practice what I call essential range of motion exercises that form the foundation of belly dance moves. In this class, we're focusing on motions of the shoulders, the arms, and the hands. These are motions that are gonna add fluidity and grace to all of your arm movements and your hand movements and actually enable you to dance with your hands, not just your hips and your chest. We'll follow that with key stretches to help all of this good stuff. So, yalla habibi, let's get started on our first exercise. Stand and face me as if you're looking in a mirror. To do the full class, click on the link in the description or go to school.gensuya.com and enroll for detailed technique instruction, relevant practice, and key stretches, all with lifetime access to this beginner belly dance class. Mm -hmm. 